What's up everybody? We're doing a ride today that is not Sand Hollow and it's not just a little short <laughs> meme video. We are doing something that I have wanted to do since I moved to St. George. We're going out on the Arizona Strip. This is one of the least populated areas of the United States and it's everywhere north of the Grand Canyon all the way up to the Utah border. It's called the Arizona Strip. There's basically nothing out here. We also have Miguel from UT Vibes with us. He's, he's with us a lot. <laughs> We, we ride together quite a bit, but I say that as if it's like some new occurrence, but he's in a lot of our stuff. So anyways, we're gonna get after it and go see if we can find something crazy. further down the road we're gonna end up going to what's called the Mount Trumbull schoolhouse um, it's an old schoolhouse it's down here in the middle of nowhere as you can see we uh, a found the snow and B found a bunch of mud and C found other jackets because of the snow except for Miguel is smarter than the rest of us and he's got his heated Milwaukee jacket shout out to Milwaukee <laughs> and I guess Steve I guess I'm the only idiot here because Steve's already bundled up. I had to throw on my other jacket. One thing you don't want to be out here with, with nobody out here. This is the kind of area that you definitely have a second vehicle. Yeah. Definitely plan on going with someone and bringing extra tools and stuff. So I guess that's a second shout out to Milwaukee because I got all my tools and everything in here just in case. made it all the way down to the Mount Trumbull schoolhouse is, is what this place is called. It's still very desolate out here, but there is obviously a road and believe it or not, there's actually people that live out here. I think there's something around 12 families that live out in this area. I'm not entirely sure about that. That could be totally made up, but you can see that there are some houses up over in these hills. I don't know. We've been driving a good two hours just through nothingness basically to get here, but we're here and I think we're about two thirds of the way to the Grand Canyon. We're not gonna do the Grand Canyon today. The craziest thing I saw, and we might end up picking these people up on the way back, but we saw two people, two boys on uh, just little like 110 cc dirt bikes with a full pack like they were camping here. On the way out, we passed them while we were coming in and that's, that's kind of wild to me. I don't know if I would trust my being out here to a 110 cc dirt bike and whatever I had on my back, but maybe that's just me. Here's the BLM poster for the, the schoolhouse. As you can see, this is Mount Trumbull, Arizona, 1916 to 2016. So it's been pretty much abandoned since 2016. I believe there was a fire or something, but let's go in and read about it, see, see what we can learn. Oh, it is muddy. So those guys that we saw on the dirt bikes, they did in fact stay in here. So who was it? Uh, one nine twenty four. It was two guys, two vehicles. CRF one two twenty five. The ones we saw. Before. Yeah, yeah. From, from Arkansas. Arkansas. Wait, that says destination. They're going to Arkansas. They're from Arkansas. Oh yeah. Well, That's weird. Fit in out Probably both. Here we slept here last night. Lovely place. Saved our lives. Keep kicking. <laughs> I imagine if this, if they were down here before this snow came in. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be in here sleeping too. That's for sure. That's pretty cool. It's, it's so weird to me that we drove so far past so much nothing. Yeah. Okay, so we're looking at the map and what we've learned is basically, it's all labeled here, but all the S's are springs, all the L's are landmarks. Where did the volcano be? But all these H's, these are for old homesteads. And if you look at this, there's a ton of these like H's. I think what's, we got 
74, 74 total. homesteads. 74 oh, homesteads wife. out. What's this? Mount Emma, buddy. 74 homesteads throughout this whole community. area slash community, which is pretty interesting. Also, just so you know, if we're if you're looking at it, this is where we're at right now. This is called the um, Mount Trumbull Schoolhouse. And the Grand Canyon Overlook is over here. Yeah, that's what you're... We're gonna try that on it next time. All right, it is getting pretty cold, so we're gonna head back. Um, if you remember those two motorcycles we passed on the way in, it seemed like they were kind of struggling. We're gonna see, maybe we can throw their bikes up here and throw them in the cars and see if they want some help getting out of here. finding the guys that were on the motorcycles and they're doing okay so we're now really close to home we're not gonna give them a ride or anything they made it out we got pretty muddy all right well those guys are okay so we're gonna head on head on back we really made pretty good time about four hours we made it all the way down there hung out for a little bit and back but it's kind of crazy how desolate it is out there we saw we saw a few cars in and out so you'd you'd probably be okay but it's there's nothing as far as structure or infrastructure out there. We gotta stop, we gotta stop. We found something important. It's just trash. But it is important, make sure you always pick up trash and don't leave any of your own trash behind because as an off-road community we need to make sure we do everything we can to not give people excuses to hate us. <laughs> 